Hey, what's up YouTube? My name is Clint and I'm a photographer from Wellington. So for the past, say, four years I've been experimenting with photography, trying out portrait, landscape, astrophotography and street photography and more recently I've been enjoying a lot more street photography basically because it's always there. So today I thought I'd share a behind the scenes look into how I created some of my more recent images. Um, I started off at the top of Hopper Street at about 6 a.m. and I made my way down Cuba Street and back up uh, before heading to work. So yeah, I hope you enjoy this video of mine. It's my first and hopefully more to come. Okay, so I started on Hopper Street uh, where I found the scene next to the car park with the graffiti on this building's wall with the light shining down I thought looked pretty cool. I eventually got onto Webb Street and I found a group of workers in a building with this bright light coming out of it that made for this really cool looking scene. As I got onto Cuba Street uh, I tried to look for interesting things like this broken down Onzo bike uh, which also looked kind of cool but yeah, I wasn't quite feeling the vibe of that. I tried to take a couple more photos uh, just to get warmed up and find uh, ideas to work off uh, and uh, yeah I eventually got to an idea where I was thinking I could try and take uh, photographs of scenes like something out of a movie that you might see. I eventually got to this building down Cuba Street uh, that looked kind of cool but I managed to take it from a different angle with this person walking in front of it which worked out pretty well. Um, the camera that I was using is my Sony a6300 with a 24 to 70 um, lens. Nothing special, but it's what I have. I found my way to this fish market down Cuba Street, which was brightly lit, uh, which I thought could look like a really cool scene um, and managed to create a really cool image out of that. I made my way further down Cuba Street looking for more ideas, um, which eventually I found this building with this bright neon arrow that was being reflected off a window. I tried to maybe see if I can take something, take an image that could look a bit better and found with the um, pay box in front of it and the car that was also in front of it look, could look like a really cool scene. Eventually I got further down to Cuba Street and experimented a bit more. But not everything was working the way I, I envisioned it. Um, but it's all experimenting, really. I look for more uh, lit up scenes, like the building with the mannequins and this bright neon sign in front of it that looked kind of cool. Um, tried for a few more photos. The sun was eventually starting to come up, so I tried my best to adjust my settings uh, to the exposures and still try to create dark scenes with it. Uh, as I got onto Taranaki Street, it, um, the sun eventually came up and it was looking quite bright out there. I tried to take a few more photographs and try and work with them, but nothing was really working. I turned up onto Guzney Street and found a few more interesting signs, but they weren't really working the way I thought it would. I then tried to create images with reflections in it bouncing off of these building um, windows. There happened to be a guy inside this cafe uh, which created a really cool looking image along with another one. Uh, as I made my way back up to Cuba Street I, went, I tried to experiment a bit more with the, um, with the photographs but by then I was kind of running out of ideas. I found one more idea with where this lady was walking uh, into this light source which also worked with the theme I was going off. Um, but yeah, I eventually needed to start heading back to work and um, that was the end of uh, that small photo walk. Uh, if you managed to stick around this long, thank you. Um, and if you like what you saw, hit that like button and leave a comment if you want if you want to maybe if you have any ideas or uh, tips or suggestions you know i'm open to, to it all but yeah thanks for watching this video and i'll hopefully see you guys next time